Hi guys, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to decode digital voice using an SDR. You should have um, probably seen my last video, which shows you how to set up the SDR Sharp program uh, with an SDR, such as the RTL chipset SDR. That's the one we're going to be using in this video. Um, so now you will need to go and download these two programs here, VB Audio VB Cable. Um, so just go over to this page and click download here. The second program you'll need is the SD. Um, this is the download page, but you can't just download it straight away and start using it. You have to have another file. So um, I recommend you go and look at my other video called Complete Guide to DSD. And in that video, I show you where you can get that other file easily and get DSD working. So once you've downloaded this program, DSD and VB Cable and installed VB Cable, then come back to the video and I'll show you what to do next. Okay, so once you've downloaded and installed those two programs, well, you don't need to install DSD, but once you've installed VB Cable, let's go back into SDR Sharp, and I'll show you what to do here. So the mode should be on narrow FM. Bandwidth can be on anything that's uh, appropriate. So if it's, if it's a narrow signal, then it should be around 12,500. That's 12. 0.5 kilohertz um, or if it's a wide signal then it'll be 25 kilohertz but I can't actually think of any wide digital signals off the top of my head that this program can decode so it will be 12,500 or 6,250 for narrow digital signals like NXDN um, the squelch, obviously that's up to you, out of these other settings here, just make sure correct IQ is on. Uh, then we go into audio settings, the audio output device has to be on cable input, so that it feeds the audio through to DSD. And filter audio should also be unchecked, because uh, that messes up, that messes with the digital if you have that checked. Then we go into the configuration up here, and you have to make sure that the sample rate is 2.048 or lower. Um, above 2.048 it drops samples, and uh, that stops the digital from decoding properly. Um, then uh, we have to go down to here, go into recording devices, so you right click on the speaker icon and go into recording devices and then click on cable output and select set default so that's your default device now and then you can go ahead and open DSD up now you should have the correct batch file for the mode that you're going to decode if you don't know anything about these batch files then go and watch my complete guide to DSD video and uh, in that video I'll tell you about these so um, DMR inverted is the correct bat file or batch file for what I'm going to be decoding here. And now let's start DSD, I'm sorry, start SDR sharp and find something to decode to show you that this is working now. In the uh, central UK. Yeah. Well, um, uh, we we had a little trouble understanding you, but uh, we got the basic gist of it. Uh, thanks for the call, and uh, we appreciate your uh, help with this. Um, whiskey Alpha Zero India Kilo Alpha. I'll say 73 to you. Uh, the name here is Jerry, but uh, we uh, we've enjoyed it. Just uh, thank you. Bye. Uh, fine on that, no problem. There was a little bit of packet loss the other way, so I could be on uh, Well, I know, I know I'm uh, running to the repeat at this end. It might be a bit of packet loss somewhere uh, across the pond, or uh, if you're fully quieting into the repeat at your end. 
Okay, same phrase, uh, Gareth, and uh, same phrase, Gerald, and anybody else there. Golf one, actually, Charlie, Charlie. Back to Stanley. Okay, so there we go. You can see that it's working nicely. And uh, I hope this video has been useful to you. Please consider subscribing, like the video if you liked it, and share it with anyone who you think might find it interesting. Thanks for watching.